All right, Mike, here is my analysis of your golf swing. First things first, face on. I love the setup. Pelvis is centered. You've got about, uh, let's say, four degrees, three degrees of tilt right there. That's perfect for a seven iron if that's what you have. I would guess it's a seven or a six. Okay, so face on. If we look at where your golf ball is, it is set up on the hosel. That is because your hands are sitting too low because the swing plane is down here at 50, which is not going to work for the iron that you have. So what we need to do is we need to get your butt more underneath you on heel line, underneath your core, which will actually stand your back line up a little bit. And that'll then put your armpits more over the balls of your feet and your knees. Okay, this is the most important thing I'm going to tell you today. So now from here, as we start to swing the club back, club face is square, love that, square to the back line. Your arm structure is phenomenal, how you fold that trail arm. Okay, yeah, that's right underneath the grip, left arm's on shoulder line, so good. Now when we go up top, here's our issue. We are turning the right side too much to where the left side is now front loading. So let's see what it continues to do here. So it turned even more inside of that. So if we go there, so that hip is way too far inside right there. So we need to get it back here closer to this red line about creating almost a golf ball of space only. Now from here, when we watch the downswing, we go down the line. So if we look at where the shaft started there, okay, we're gonna see this thing steepens just a little bit. So this left arm is trying to pull the club out in front, pulling the arms out in front, and then we're trying to time hold off with pull around the corner. So trying to hold the face off it looks like because how much the butt has come under, back line has stood up just like we predicted, and the head has also backed up. So the head's backed up, which is gonna cause the right arm to have to throw, but you're also trying to hold at the same time. So you're trying to pull and hold the golf club faster than what you can actually push out of it with this lead side. So that would be my analysis right there. We need to fix this trail hip and get it more in line with where that red line is. And then the other thing we've got to fix is we've got to get set up to look more like this. So this 151, 152 number, okay? Because that is going to get your butt more on heel line, which is going to be very beneficial. So when that gets more on heel line, you'll then see the armpits will sit more in line with the balls of the feet and the knees. The hands will start to sit up a little bit higher and the golf club will sit more on this plane, which is exactly what you're gonna deliver it on. That's what I would see as being optimal for you.